Imagine satellites in space shooting down threats. It sounds like science fiction, but not anymore. The US is planning to develop a next-level defense system to intercept incoming missiles from space, with testing expected as soon as 2028, as part of a huge program called Golden Dome. So, how will the US space-based interceptor work, and how much could it cost? Is a space-based interceptor really possible? If yes, could it intercept every kind of threat, including hypersonic missiles? Earlier in 2025, the US announced its plan to develop a space-based defense system called the Golden Dome, but it was not clear whether a space-based interceptor would be included. Now it has been confirmed that the system will feature space-based interceptors. The Golden Dome is a major US defense project being developed on a fast track. It is projected that actual operational capacity may begin between 2029 and 2035, depending on scale and funding. Initially, $25 billion has been allocated, and the U.S. government projects the overall cost at around $175 billion. However, some experts warn it could reach $542 billion or more over 20 years. The Golden Dome system would rely on a network of satellites positioned in low Earth orbit. It would consist of 400 to 1,000 tracking satellites to identify and monitor threats, along with a separate fleet of about 200 armed satellites, each equipped with six kinetic interceptors to neutralize those threats. Some reports suggest the number of satellites could be even higher to ensure global coverage. Armed satellites equipped with lasers could also become part of the Golden Dome once laser technology is sufficiently advanced. In short, the Golden Dome would be a system designed to evolve and expand over time, meaning its budget could increase multiple times beyond the initial estimates. The system would use advanced sensors, artificial intelligence, and rapid response propulsion to ensure minimal reaction time. There are multiple challenges ahead in developing the Golden Dome space-based threat detectors and interceptors. The first challenge is its massive cost, as deploying and maintaining thousands of satellites in orbit would require enormous resources. Reloading armed satellites would also be expensive, and adversaries could attempt to overwhelm the system by launching large numbers of low-cost missiles. Technically, the system would require an extremely fast reaction time. Its goal is to intercept missiles during the boost phase, which lasts only 10 to 20 minutes. This means the system would need to respond and transfer data within milliseconds. Since the Golden Dome satellites would be in low Earth orbit, they would need frequent altitude adjustments to avoid orbital decay. Moreover, space-based interceptors would be vulnerable to anti-satellite weapons, and the loss of even a few satellites could impact the entire system's effectiveness. Now, let's look at its main goal. Can it stop every threat, including hypersonic weapons? The recent development of hypersonic missiles by Russia and China poses a serious risk to the US, as its current defense systems cannot intercept them. Hypersonic missiles travel at more than five times the speed of sound and maneuver unpredictably, making them extremely difficult to intercept. The Golden Dome could perform far better than conventional interceptors, because it would detect and engage threats from space, significantly improving reaction time, expanding targeting range, and striking missiles in their early stages, when they are easier to destroy. However, experts emphasize that no defense system, including the Golden Dome, can block every single missile. While it may not achieve perfect interception, it is expected to perform far better than earlier systems. Its primary aim is not flawless protection, but to make any attack so risky and unlikely to succeed that adversaries are deterred from attempting it. The real-world performance of space-based interceptors remains uncertain, but one thing is clear. Deploying hundreds of tracking satellites under the Golden Dome project could greatly enhance the US's threat detection capability and strengthen its ground-based interception systems.